because we've just we're at the intersection of community engagement and technology. And as the mayor likes to say, now these young people will have access that matches their potential. They'll have access to technology that matches their potential. For many of us, our computer serves as a bookstore, a record store. I'm dating myself by saying that, obviously. An iPad serves as our newspaper and encyclopedia. Digital access has become just as important for us as a library. But for too many communities in Chicago, the divide between the haves and the have-nots deepens when businesses and residents do not have reliable digital connection to their city and the world. While cities around the globe are installing fiber optic networks to connect their communities with one another and with the world, some of our own communities were falling further behind. That's why initiatives like today's are so important to our neighborhoods and our communities and to Chicago's future. Serving as the Director of Mayor's Office of Public Engagement, I work on building these types of partnerships. The partnerships between police and pastors, the partnerships between communities, principals, parents, private partners, bringing them together. We try to work to promote the efforts to connect our residents. What I do is what we've done today. I try to build personal and community networks to strengthen neighborhoods, but in this networked age, neighborhoods often need access to digital networks if they are able to develop and find the services that they need. That's why the effort and investments here today are so important to the effort, and all our efforts to connect residents with essential services, their support that they need and economic opportunity. These investments are crucial, a really crucial part of the broader investments we see in Chicago's foundations for growth. Today, on the south side, we see many vital projects related to infrastructure. The governor talked about this. Our roads and our rails that connect communities to downtown. The entire south end of the Red Line and 95th Street Station are being repaired to move residents faster and more efficiently to and from work and their communities. These investments are essential, but so are the investments in our vital infrastructure. Asphalt and steel are not sufficient foundations for economic growth in the 21st century. In an economy built on knowledge and networks, communities need not just roads, runways, and rails, but fiber optic and broadband connections to succeed. So today, we are helping to lay the foundation for these communities' success and for Chicago's success. The Gigabit Challenge grant also complements many of the city's other efforts on the south side and throughout the city. Earlier this year, the mayor announced our continued partnership with Comcast to provide discounted computers and internet access to students in public schools. This pairs with that and matches it. The Comcast Internet Essential Program is the largest public-private partnership of its kind in the country, making computers available for $150 a family, and the internet available in our students' homes for about $10 a month, and providing families with the tools, the digital tools that they need to really engage. This year, any student who receives a discounted lunch has the opportunity to participate, and that's more than 300,000 students across our city. Today, our work together and with the help of the state, world-class institutions like the University of Chicago, more of Chicago's families and businesses will have the digital connections they need that will determine their future and ours. It is these types of public-private partnerships that are essential in our communities for their very vitality and growth in the future. Every day we see the promise of this city depends on the power of our partnerships. Today, in this partnership to provide broadband and better opportunities to our neighborhoods, we all have one more reason to be encouraged about Chicago's future. And again, as one of those young people who lived on the south side of Chicago, I remember having to go to the library, card catalog, and all of those things. Today, we are laying the foundation. So not just you know on paper, uh, fiber optic, and partnership, those foundations to really help the next generation of young people in Chicago. And this is an exciting time. So thank you so much. Well thank done. you, Governor. Very good there, Felicia.